Hello guys. Hello. This is uh, George in the Mirror, and this is our kind of new segment called Impression Reaction, where basically I'm going to we watch a movie and we're going to just give our straight thoughts right after the movie. No bullshit, no writing. We're going to just movie, then our We thoughts. literally just watched we it just right watched now. It. And our first movie that we just watched is called Death Gasm. Oh yeah, that was a... Yeah. It had a slow start to begin with. Well first, I guess we should probably start like... Uh, kind of the setup. Yeah, it has a slow start. Slow start. It really didn't really uh, come into play till like thirty minutes, forty minutes. Thirty more, forty minutes into the movie, so it has a kind of a slow build up. But basically, it's kind of uh, an homage to this kind of death music or death metal, and it does a good, you know, sense of like the art and everything. Yeah, and the gore. I, I think. Yeah. I think they did a representation of metal mm -hmm. very well. Mm -hmm. Like how people think in their own mind. Yeah. It wasn't just like, oh, fuck. Mm -hmm. Well, they, with that too, actually. It was mm -hmm. kind of like, fuck a bit. Yeah. And just, I don't know. I mean, I kind of found it not to be like a super good movie. Kind of just like you can watch it. Yeah. You know, it's not going to look I mean, it's not... All right, this movie's not like a last gonna leave a big lasting impression on you. I feel like it's not a big dr dramatic movie. It's kind of a. It's movie fun to watch. Fun to watch. It, it pays homage to this whole the whole you know death metal and stuff like while that. making it entertaining with badass mm -hmm. things like um, demons. Fucking. That's what's gonna go with like the gore and stuff. Yeah. The gore wasn't too bad. I feel like they could have done a little bit more with it though. Yeah, but I like the cheap uh, gore they have. Mm -hmm. Like they didn't make it. Over dramatic, or I mean, it may over dramatic, of course, is mm -hmm. how to do it. Well, I feel like they could have done like maybe overdo it, you know, over Show more it. guts and blood and stuff. You yeah, know? it felt a little too, a little too tame. That's something. I mean, I don't know. They got parts where, oh, yeah, there's gonna be spoilers by the way, don't give a fuck, you know, the show dildos and pupils and stuff. Like oh, that. yeah, yeah. Um, I'll claim my little spoiler alert, by the way. If you want to watch it, should we should we say a recommendation? Watch it or not watch it right now? Or, uh, yeah, I guess we should give. Yeah, it. before we get spoiled. Yeah. Okay. So you go first. I say it's probably not worth a watch to be honest. I mean, give it like a circumstance, like ways you could watch it. Ways, ways you, you could. could. If you're a fan, of course, of the death minute death music you know genre and whatever i think you'd probably be a fan of it but really if you're not really into that i don't think you're gonna find much out of it i have to disagree on some parts of that mm -hmm. i think it's fun to watch with friends mm -hmm. like to see how dumb it is mm -hmm. in some parts and i think the the gore the action mm -hmm. like there's some funny things there's funny moments mm -hmm. in the movie that was actually funny and creative mm -hmm. I thought sure there was dumb stuff, but if you're into that, with it's more a story. Yeah, it's more, it's more trying. It's trying to become a story when it's mm. not a story. I see what you're saying. See, I feel like maybe some of the action was kind of funny, but the writing wasn't all that great, to be honest. I feel because the they, it would, they were trying. There it was a little because they had this whole love story, which I kind of I didn't like. Yeah, I, like I didn't care for it. I thought I like I don't know. I thought I, I'm a cheese. Mm -hmm. Well, for this, like, and like, I thought it was cute. Like, there's no fucking other girl that didn't like any metal kid, but this girl is like secretly, they're like, like mean, secretly want to be metal. I wish it was probably more about the the two best friends and them trying to solve, you know, more about the metal music stuff. But now they have this whole little side story, and they try to add this little drama part, which kind of goes nowhere, to be honest. Honestly, because I get, yeah, because there's this um. The main character of this movie, Zach. No, it's all. No, it's not Zach. Brody. 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 Uh, he's basically he's this metal kid who his mom goes to like a ward, so now he has to live with his uh, aunt and uncle, and now uh, he, uh, you know, gives in, lives in his crappy town and he get, doesn't feel it in because no one cares about metal music. But then he meets this guy Zach, who's another metalhead like him, and for and they become you feel that they're becoming really good friends with the relationship with the music and everything but for some reason he's his friend Zach just betrays him and just sleeps with his girl no he doesn't sleep with her girl but you he know, kisses her and whatever like this I what think is this? no I think they ended like 
in the window. They mm-hmm. that she, she, Cause he sleeping. sniffed a little note and whatever. I'm like, what, what, what no, is this? No, no, no. I think in the window, like, because there was this jacket in the backpack. Yeah. And he was grabbing the ass and the titties of her. Yeah. And he said he just wanted to fly. Yeah, I guess he's just, like bored, but I was like, all right, well, this is, this, this kind of got nowhere. Yeah. It's just so they can bring back the little little comeback over his redemption coming back so I was like <gasps> yeah. it's, it, it, it kind of goes nowhere for me I mean he was like the unnecessary asshole yeah exactly you know I would have felt like a little bit just cooler there were just two guys just trying to fight this thing and fight to fight all those demons and that's the other thing I kind of have a complaint about too what the demons I didn't like they, yeah. they could have done more with them I don't like when they just make demon zombies you know, demon demons, songs. demons do more than just, uh, they're demons like. Okay, and I do have a point too. Mm. The very end when he turns it, a oh, spoiler, yeah. uh, the very end where Zack turns into the demon king. Mm. I'm like, you hey, look, there's, there's, a, there's a difference from look, looking bad, but still funny, uh, from looking bad, like what the fuck. Uh, that was the what the you fuck. You didn't think it looked good? It. Yeah, I they, thought, they I thought, downgraded that I thought that his one. neck looked a little too weird. Yeah. yeah. But I thought it looked okay as a demon uh, effect. Well, also the, the lightning. Yeah. yeah, that was pretty bad, bad. I feel like the demon could have... I feel like for what he was, you know, this big demon king, he kind of died pretty easily. Yeah, yeah, honestly. He just did it with the right. I think he could have done a lot more, but... I, I think they tried to put a message like... Mm-hmm. like his music saved him. Yeah. yeah. No whole power like friendship and ever. But that's why I feel like it's not that strong because the guy's an asshole. His friend Zach. You know? Yeah. I feel like they're not really... At parts, I feel like maybe they're kind of good friends but then at some parts, you know, they're just, you know, yeah. arguing and stuff. It's like, are these guys even really friends? But, I don't know. But there were some, like, I would say one of the most bad scenes I saw Oh, what? yeah. There's two. There's two uh, of them. Well, go to the the cult thing. The cult. Okay. Yeah. There was this cult. Unnecessary to destroy. Yeah. I say unnecessary. Like they call them, like three parts. Mm-hmm. Beginning, middle, end. That's yeah. Literally all. And I was I forget that they were there. Yeah, exactly. But, but the first part was the badass part with with the guy killing the singer of some celebrity mm-hmm. right and he kills him but he didn't get the paper the that sent that mm-hmm. brings the hell gate open yeah because um what happens is that these two friends they go to this like old metal rocker mm-hmm. who apparently has this music that had that summons hell it doesn't apparently it's, he has this music that summons hell and there's this cult and the reason they find him because well, well, why did they find him because his location got yeah, yeah 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 they were gonna they were gonna um house arrest him they were gonna uh, kill him yeah they were gonna kill him yeah it was an eviction notice mm-hmm. and the eviction was to kill him yeah and uh they didn't know that and they were gonna die he saved his life the singer actually saved their life yeah because he, he didn't them, rat them out he told them to go yeah to told grab, him. And, grab and go yeah. but I wish you should have told them like hey this is the someone's hell. Don't believe this, yeah. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, I wish there was more story to him. Yeah. yeah, why he got the music and everything. Mm-hmm. They didn't see. explain that. Yeah. They didn't explain, and he was pretty cool because mm-hmm. he did save their life and everything. Yeah, they even did, though they, they, they kind of do a quick briefing that he was just like hailing Satan for some reason, but they, you know, kind of like why does he is he? They never him? said it again. Yeah. That's a big problem. But anyway, the call failed to. Uh, one of the hitmen did failed, and he was scared and everything. Didn't find. And the guy, this is the most badass part, by the way. The guy was like ordering the um, the cold leader, the cold leader. Yeah. Ordered him to get his head chopped off, mm-hmm. and then he was like, and the most badass and funny part. Was, uh-huh. I'll, I'll agree with this. Yes. Uh, was it was like wait, ah oh, guys, you forgot to put the tarp on, <laughs> and it's like it's like you want know to do it again, mm-hmm. and then it's like and they they, they were struck. At first, at first, the only thing touch up they could do was kill the um. There's two executioners. Mm-hmm. They could have killed the other executioner. Yeah, I think they should have done that. But no, they just which just the head back. They put the head back up, the head back right. up and they did a weak one, <laughs> which was funny too. Yeah, and they put the tarp. And the real big the, 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 the last twist was there was a desk in front of him, and the whole time, 
a girl was sucking him off. Now, I was I was thinking this during the movie. Was that the same chick that killed the cult leader? Yes, it was. That was the same chick? Yes, it was. Okay, so. That's why, and you know what, maybe? Oh, in society, mm-hmm. you know, if you want to go far, you're trying to go, you can't trust yeah, someone yeah, sucking you your dick. You can't trust people that sucking your dick. Naked, yeah. Because they will backstab. And or that's what happened. maybe she you gotta, you gotta suck something to, to get ahead in life. Because look what happened. She, she was able well, to kill him. Then, yeah, that's the second part. She killed him and become mm-hmm. there. And then, actually, I think everyone gets killed in this in the three parts. They did this on purpose. First one was the hitman got mm-hmm. killed. The uh, then the cutlery got killed. Then a new cutlery got killed by Zach. Mm-hmm. And it was all backstabs. Yeah, basically. God. But uh, the music was really good. I, I enjoyed the music in this movie. Oh, yeah. That's the one plus. Like I said, they really pay homage to the whole uh, death metal. And which I'm not the biggest fan. Yeah, I'm not the biggest fan either. Like, especially Screamo. I hate Screamo. But they pay homage to it. And when they when listen to the metal music, it's funny as fuck for me. Mm-hmm. Because, like, it's a mountain. And it's like, there's yeah. two girls right there. Even, mm-hmm. um, like, two naked girls. It's like, <laughs> Tell me how to make you feel. Yeah. 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 I'm just, that's, that's true to my That's true, man. Well, you got anything else to say about it? Um... I didn't say my. I think. I think you should watch it. You think you should watch it? I, I say it's. Unless you're a fan of death metal music or just kind of just got nothing better to do and you see that's on, maybe you should check it out. I think. But I don't think you're really going to get much out of it. I think you should watch it to pay homage to it. Because people, even without fans of metal, mm-hmm. I think will pay a little respect to it. Well, I feel there's a. Because I did. I pay a little respect. Yeah, but there, I feel like there's some better movies like uh, Heavy Metal. That kind of does a little better with the whole heavy metal genre playing into the movie. I see that. I just feel like it could have done a little bit more with it, the heavy metal in this. Oh, we forgot one part. Like you should what? The very end. We. I did not like that. Oh, the little. They try to build up a, a like a, a sequel to it. Yeah, I was so confused. I did not want to. Like because his friend Zach, the main character Brody, his friend Zach dies because so, uh, his, his friend Zach becomes the demon king. And apparently he did that to, to kind of like sacrifice himself. And uh, Brody, he plays their own music to uh, make the Demon King realize who that Zack is really in there. And he dies, he sacrifices himself because Brody kills him so he can kill the demon. And But he appears as a ghost. Like I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it, is yeah the, record? the record the record was playing yeah. and it's like, I was like... I, I need help or something. I don't yeah. Know. I don't or know. he's just like, hey, I'm no, I'm just fucking with you or something. I don't, I don't know. know. I guess they're trying to set up a sequel. I honestly don't know. Death Gasm too. Yeah, and the two other friends died too. Yeah. I was like, I, I didn't like how they did that. Mm. They should have done it like one by one. I mean, I liked them, but I I got I realized why they died though. I mean, they're fucking they're useless. <laughs> they would just die. Yeah. Yeah. Oh well, I I really I related to the fat guy. <laughs> True. All right. All right. I think that's all. All right. Or Death Gazza. Death Gazza. He doesn't recommend it. I recommend it. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Make your own opinion.